guys, PD here. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another new video. Today we're trying something a little bit different. Uh, I'm not in VR. I've just downloaded Dreams on the PlayStation Store. Um, it cost me £34. I've just downloaded it. It's just installed. I'm playing with the uh, PlayStation 4 controller. Now this game is getting VR support very, very soon. So I thought I would dive in, check it out. Show you guys what's available, that sort of thing, so we can get a good feel of what type of VR games we're going to be playing in this game. There's been some tweets on Twitter from uh, developers saying that they've tried the, the VR mode and they're really, really impressed. So, okay, I'm going to select my controller scheme. I'm using the wireless controller. And there is an option there for the move controllers. Now this game has been developed by one of my all-time favourite developers. In the beginning. Nothing. And they did Little Big Planet. No movement. No sound. Complete emptiness. Then something. A speck. An idea. The idea could be anything. It could be... Everything! Okay, got a really cool intro playing now. Light. Color. Shapes. Sounds. And most exciting of all, life. Everyone can conduct this power. Everyone has an imp. Imps are the key to the power of the Dreamiverse. My control is vibration the Dreamiverse now. teams with their energy, waiting for you to choose your very own. Which one is yours? Choose your imp. This game has been developed by one of my all-time favourite developers, and they gave us the Little Big Planet, and also Tear Away, which was a really cool game on the PlayStation. And with Tear Away, it's one of those games where you have to blow into your controller to get characters and things to move. Really, really underrated game. Now Dreams is all about um, creating your own games and exploring games that other people have made. And it's getting a VR mode. And the VR mode apparently is nearly done, so I thought I'd buy the game, download it and get a feel of it. So that when the VR mode is supported, we'll be able to play these games in VR. Okay, choose your imp. Let's go for the epic purple one. Yes! That one belongs to you. Oh, I'm moving it. Okay, so now the imp is following my can do. controllers. Press and hold the options button. Very similar to how um, AstroBot works. Okay, my preferences, control scheme, camera, display, audio, motion blur, audio. It looks really nice so far. Let me check my camera. Invert camera. I'm going to leave it alone for now. Okay, so I'm going to press and hold the options button. Yes, great. Your imp responds to the smallest movements of your wireless controller. That's because it's attached to the controller's motion sensor. You only need to move the controller a teeny tiny amount to get your imp to respond. Go on, move your imp around a bit. Think of the light bar on the front of the controller as a flashlight beam conducting your imp. Okay, so like in VR, it's using the uh, blue light there of creativity. Move the pointy as a tracking to touch it. system. That's it. 
Now, collect those two clusters at the top and bottom. See how that feels. Yes, magnificent. You can also nudge the imp against the edge of the screen to recalibrate it. Okay, very cool. Anytime your imp gets unruly, press and hold the options button to recenter it. Recenter him. Now, let's play with the Dreamiverse. See if you can catch all those dancing shapes. Unleash those colours and sounds. And my controller's vibrating when I interrupt these objects. I'm getting some really cool Astrobot vibes already. Very good! You're a natural. Wow! It's a symphony. See how your imp can affect everything it touches. Wandering, soaring and leaping. Playing to the wilds of your imagination. You're amazing. You're wonderful. You're a dream surfer. You're... Okay, really cool effects. Oh no. You found the wall of doubt. Don't worry, everyone doubts themselves in the beginning. See that loose break? Try using the pointy tip of your imp to grab hold of it. Okay, right to... That's it. Pull that wall down. This is really Look impressive, guys. Rick, who does it think it is? Get rid of it! I can only imagine this in VR. Your idea is getting away. Chase it down. Okay, right two. I did create a few games on the uh, little big planet. It should be in here somewhere. Oh. More barriers! Cast them aside! Really, really enjoying the interaction here. There it is! Come on, Dreamer! Keep up! So far, this is just uh, like a tutorial. Mmm, dark. The only source of energy is... Me! You! What can you do? Oh, we can light the light bulb. Press the X button. One, two, three, dream. Press the circle. Ah, we have light. A good start. If only we had a way of exploring this place. Really impressive so far. Now we're really getting somewhere. Okay, left plus X. Okay, we're now controlling this character using the uh, thumbstick. How cool is this? I've seen a few trailers on YouTube where people have um, recreated Sonic already. Some way to get up there. Okay, he wants to get up here. Can I move the ball? Oh. oh! Oh, there we go. Like a switch there. Great ah. work! We're so close! I'm also getting some really cool moss vibes ah, with the uh, platforming. Seedling. The Dreamiverse loves to help things grow. Press the circle. Okay, let's grab the uh, watering can. That's it. 
Amazing what a little nurturing can do. Almost there. So this is like the next evolution of uh, Little Big Planet. We're here at last. Dreams, your vast, vibrant, sublime universe of possibilities. Let's start dreaming. A Little Big Planet was amazing, so interactive, so unique. I had many, many hours in there, Little Big Planet. Okay, that's the intro over, I do believe. This is my home space. I like to decorate it with fantastical creations from my journeys through the Dreamiverse. My little cone friend here is happy to help you wander around. Okay, so this is like my hub area. Head over to the glowing orb to open the main menu. Okay, let me just save the game. Okay, press the L in X, jump. So this is like the hub area. And this is where you get to explore the different worlds and the different games that people make for the for this game. Okay, that's saying to hit the main menu. Where will you begin? Choose dream surfing to start playing, or choose dream shaping if you want to start creating. I'm going to select the Dream Surfing. We're going to see what people have made already. And this game came out on the uh, 14th of February. Let's go surfing. Let's see what we can find. Ah, Dream Surfing. Here we can explore the wilds of the Dreamiverse. Slipping and sliding through the strangest and most wonderful ideas and creations. Lose yourself in the kaleidoscope of games, animations, music videos, and all sorts of worlds and experiences made by dreamers just like you. Dream surfing is a never ending, ever changing stream of dreamers' imaginations. Let's try it out. This is going to be fun. Welcome to Dream Surfing. Explore all that the Dreamiverse has to offer, organised into playlists to help you find what you like. Now I'm looking at this game just for the VR part of the game. I don't think I'll be playing these Pancake. I'm going to be uh, jumping into these VR experiences. And uh, these are going to, there's going to be endless games. You're going to have an endless supply of VR games. And if you want to, you can create your own VR game. Now I know the power of uh, Little Big Planet. I know how good it was. I created a few little games in there, only platform games. Uh, but this is the next evolution. It's going to be amazing, guys. Okay, what we're we going for? Let's go for what's that blade gunner? Okay, let's go for one that's got some really high likes. This one here, where is it? Just another natural disaster, 14k lights. Single player. And it's a Rampage style game. Photos, comments. Okay, so how do we um, jump into the game? Play. Now imagine this in 3D, in VR, on the PlayStation VR. Okay, let's go for classic mode. Are 
breaking news. Go live to Princess City, where after a series of natural disasters, a giant unidentified creature has emerged off the coast. Helicopters are rushing to the scene. Is that me? Could the creature possibly want? Now these are all games created by people like you and me. Oh, there we go. So I'm now controlling this um, giant gozo type creature. Come here. Destroy the boat. Okay, it's a little dark. Could do with a torch. Okay, so we've got toggle camera. Attack the court. Politicians are wanting to take lethal force against the creature. However, scientists are opposed. We've got a laser beam. Authorities are requesting that all citizens evacuate the city. Breaking news. The military is scrambling aircraft as we speak. I don't know if all the games will be in VR. I don't know if it's like um, only uh, specific titles. Can I get that plane with a laser beam? Look at that. Like Godzilla. There's jet fighters there. So this is showing you the potential, what types of games people can make. And everybody shares the uh, creations, so you can make objects in the game that people can share. You can create effects. That laser beam, look at that. Pretty cool. I'm already excited. It's just in. Despite all attacks, the creature continues its rampage. Okay, let's check out another experience. Okay, how do I go back? Exit. Really easy to um, control and everything. Follow user. So if I wanted to, if you're on my friends list, I can send you the game to play. Report the game. Okay, let's check out. Oh, we've got some more games there. Um, if I scroll down. So there's a there's game here, a lot with people playing. Temple games, single player games, Cosmic Sands. I'm looking for the, uh, someone's recreated the Sonic. Already there's loads of worlds. New trending dreams, okay, what's this one? That's a gallery. That looks like um, Walt Disney World. There's a little, little big planet. Sack boy from the game. Mario, okay, let's check out Mario. Oh wow, look at this. So someone's recreated a Mario type game. The 3D will work a lot better in VR as well. Pretty impressive guys, don't you think? Okay, do we need to jump on the pipes? It's me, Mario. Quite a lot to explore as well. Okay, let's check out one more. Let's check out that... Um, the picture one. We've got uh, pick selection, forever popular, community jams, 
Fallout 4. Dreams Edition. So someone's uh, recreated Fallout 4. Newest Dreams. Created by people at a similar level to you. So lots to explore and discover. Let's check out this one. This is highlighted. And there's 340 people playing it. And it's a game, apparently. Epic adventure. Art's dream. Created entirely in dreams by Media Molecule. Okay, so this is a full game. Created by the people who made the game Dreams. So this is by the uh, developers who made Dreams. So what you see on screen now, you can create yourself in the game with the uh, creation okay. tools. Great. You're here. Brilliant. Let me tell you a story. Okay. Like all great stories, it's got action, laughter, a real mean bad guy. And the most important ingredient of all. Music. I'm on. And I play the double bass. The greatest of all instruments. You know, I used to think I was the best. The bee's knees. But actually, I was really down in the dumps. And then some. Rock bottom. The baddest of bad places. Really cool art style. If it wasn't for this dream, I would never have come back. I do like the art style. Dream felt so real, but but now I can't really remember it all. It's it's kind of fuzzy. <laughs> like my helpers, those fuzzy, fluffy imp things. They made me remember the things I didn't want to. Okay, so removing this character now. As soon as this game gets VR support, I'll jump in again and we'll look at some of the uh, VR games to play. And I'll give you my uh, impressions. Put the light on. Really, really enjoying this art style. I just want to look around in VR. Okay, open the door. Hi, Layla. And the band. Okay, what's that? Some records. Our first album with a proper label. We were going to hit the big time. About to play our first major gig at the Cherry Tree before I, before I left. Can I play this? Yep, yeah, that's really cool. I'm playing the double bass. Sometimes you can it's only really see string. clearly in your dreams, like a light has come on in your mind. Show them what I mean, MP. Okay, we shine the light. I need to turn it on first. What's that floating there? Honey, you have to tone it down. You're drowning out me and the band. Tone it down? Why don't you all tone it up? I'm the only one trying here. You want it toned down? Fine. I'm gone. That toned down enough for you? You see, you okay. Yeah. Like I said, 
I was in a bad place. But it wasn't always like that. Later okay. Me, we were best friends. We've been playing together since we were kids. What's that? That's debug. It's a debug. I remember dreaming about debug. He was Astro my little robot that lit up. Well, till his battery died. Can I uh, control him? How you feel, DB? Dad's briefcase. I was never even allowed to open the boring thing. You can feel the uh, haptic feedback as well when you. What are you doing in there? Miller plates all the objects. Oh, me and Layla used to play with them all the time. Francis could smash anything, and Foxy was a super duper sharpshooter. I really, really want to see a pod racing game in VR in dreams. Okay, guys, I'll leave it there. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Be sure to hit my little bell, and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget, as soon as this game gets VR support, I'll jump in, I'll play some of the VR games, and give you my impressions. So I'll see you later. Thank you for watching. Bye!